Hi there. Welcome to the video where I'll explain the new BTC Pay for WooCommerce version 2 plugin and connect it to your BTC Pay service tour. As a requirement, I assume you have your WooCommerce store set up and your BTC Pay server configured with a store. So let's head over to our WordPress installation. Here we can easily install the plugin. So let's go to plugins, add new. In the search bar in the top right, you type BTC Pay V2. And here we have the plugin. We install it. And now we activate it. So now it is activated. But because we don't have it configured yet, we see this message up here. Don't worry, it's easy to configure. Click on the link and we will get redirected to the BTC Pay Settings tab. If you do not click that link, you can always find that under WooCommerce Settings tab. This is where you want to put in your URL for your BTC Pay server instance. And the next step is to click here on the link. This link will take us back to our BTC Pay server to generate API keys for WooCommerce to use. So on this page, we now need to select the store for which we want to grant the API key permissions. If you have one store, only one will be shown and select that for every choice. It will preview here the one store you have configured. Let's do it for all the permissions. Alright, so now all the permissions have the same store set up. And now we click Authorize App. We will get redirected back to our WordPress installation. Now we can see it automatically picked up the API key and the store ID for us. For now, we don't need to configure any details. This will be discussed in another video on what you can configure with these settings. So what is important here is that we need to click save here again because it will create a webhook on the store and configure everything for us. So let's click save. And now we can see here that the webhook was created successfully. So now if you go to your BTC Pay server store, so click on settings, then click webhooks, and we can see it successfully created the webhook. So, now that we have the basic connection set up, we can go back to WordPress, click the Payments tab, and configure our payment per gateway. You can see here, right now it's disabled. Click here to enable it. And we can also check the settings. By default, you'll see this text here. It will provide Bitcoin and Bitcoin Lightning Network as a description. But this depends on what you configured in your store. In our case, we configured the Bitcoin wallet and Lightning wallet, so the description is just fine. Here, we can upload an icon if we want. You can configure a specific icon, but by default, it'll show the BTC Pay logo. So, now that we have that all done, we can test and see if everything's working. Now let's click on your store, and to test this out, let's buy a hat. We proceed to checkout. And now we can see our BTC payment option. And if you have multiple payment options, you'll see those all listed here. 
So we now click to proceed to BTC Pay. And here we go. You can select Lightning or Bitcoin. And now the payment should be received. Okay, now let's return to the store. And it looks like everything's working. Thank you for watching and feel free to join our Mattermost if you have any more questions.